Many thanks to Nav and Jerb for making this video possible. Over the last week I've shot every house, factory, vehicle, wall, warehouse, tower, door, fence, post, window, bunker, container, everywhere your mind cares to imagine to gather the info on what can be shot through and what cannot. A lot of hours went into this video and on my journey I've discovered such things as the inner walls on the camera buildings, you can shoot through those, or how wooden houses, some of them are made of paper mache. There's a lot to learn in this video. But before we get started you have to understand that pen power is the measure of a weapon or ammo type's ability to wallbang. During every structure we look at, I will be giving surfaces a number which will indicate the lowest required pen power you need to wallbang that surface. So everything above this line will shoot through the surface if it's a 12 for example. I've also included a scoring system that tests the ceilings, outer walls, windows, floors, inner walls and doors. Then I've done some quick maths to compare each structure in game with an average structure score. As a really quick example here, the barracks buildings requires a repeater to wallbang. The repeater has a pen power of 19, so anything above 19 will shoot through this door. So we give the door a score of 19. Got it? Great. Now the fact that Calfid19 is on your screen right now is purely coincidental. And also let's be mature and not mention that we're using pen powers to probe average structure scores, okay? That was an accident too, just in case any YouTube demonetizers are watching right now. Anyway, there are links below if you want to skip to a certain building if you wish, which means you can use this video as a resource to quickly see how to kill a camper in a particular building. That's pretty cool. However, there's so much for you to discover in this video that I would recommend watching all of it and I will be testing you based on what's in this video to see if you're a wallbang boss yet. That test will be in a future video. For now though, let's do this in alphabetical order starting with apartment buildings. Some glass surfaces on this building are bulletproof, all the doors are bulletproof but inner walls can be shot through with 30 or higher. Floors can be shot through with 35 or higher but only in the stairwell. You can shoot through into the central column with an 8 or higher. The roof box balls can be shot through with 16 or higher too. When this is filled it cannot be shot through otherwise it can be shot through with 8 or higher. This structure cannot be shot through at all, not even the frame or the logs. Only the party tent requires 8 or higher to penetrate, the others are easily shot through though. No parts of the watchtower can be shot through from the outside but you can shoot through the floors and the stairs with 8 or higher. The base of the flagpole cannot be shot through but the wooden part can be. Generators and their lights can be shot through with 11 or higher. You cannot shoot through the staircase wall here, the upstairs northern wall can be shot through there with 43 or higher. Nothing special about this house block. This is what most house blocks are like, difficult to shoot through apart from the doors and the windows. Again house blocks aren't anything special. You can shoot through most of the walls in this building with 43 on the outer walls and 30 on the inner walls but you cannot shoot through the floors. There are 4 house blocks like this one, this is the only one that allows you to shoot through the staircase wall with 30 or higher. This is the third house block with the staircase wall which cannot be shot through. This counter that has a cash register on it has a surface you cannot shoot through on the back. The metal here can be shot through with 11 or more though. Apart from the doors and the windows, this house block is very difficult to shoot through like most house blocks. This house block has a bulletproof door but you can shoot through the metal in the front with 11 or higher. In this house block the inner wall can be shot through with 35 or higher. This house block doesn't let you shoot through the metal part here but does allow you to shoot through the door with 16 or higher. You cannot shoot through the floors or the stairs here. This is the same as the last house block, nothing out of the ordinary. This is the corner house block, only the doors can be shot through. This is the fourth and final house block with the staircase wall which cannot be shot through. This is one of two variants of the restaurant house block. This corner house block has a toilet wall that you can shoot through with 30 or more. Almost exactly the same as the last one, this variant of corner house block has no toilet like the previous variant. This is the second variant of the restaurant house block, no differences between the two. The red brick single house has nothing out of the ordinary. Like all brick houses in the game this is very difficult to shoot through. This one has doors that you cannot shoot through at all, the outer walls can be shot through with 43 though. Difficult to shoot through, the shutters on the windows require 8 or more. This building is interesting, you cannot shoot through the floor here but you can shoot through the roof to kill campers if you can get onto the roof. The porch can be shot through with 43 or higher but the wooden part here can be shot through much easier. On this two story wooden greenhouse with the balcony you can shoot through the inner walls with 30 or higher. This building is pretty damn bulletproof. 
This building which is very similar, the inner wall here can be shot through very easily, only requiring 12 to shoot through. The doors are strong on this building requiring 16 and the upper balcony thingy here can be shot through with 35 or higher. The southern and western walls on this wooden house can be shot through with 43 or higher. Beware that the window frames require 11 or higher to shoot through. The porch here requires 30 or more to shoot through and the inner walls can be shot through with 35 or higher. This house is a bit of a meme, the buckshot at 8 goes straight through everything in this house but nothing can shoot through the fireplace or the wardrobe. Apart from the windows and doors, this is one of the stronger wooden houses. On this building you can shoot through the walls with 43 or higher and all of the outer walls with 30 or higher. The ceiling can be shot through with 35. This house can be shot through with 43 or higher on all sides. This is the same as a previous building, just a different colour. It can be shot through from all sides with the 43. The door and the ceiling here requires 30 or higher and you can shoot through the inner walls with 43 or higher. This is the same as a previous house, very strong, 30 on the ceiling and 43 on the inner wall. This is the other meme house, easily shot through like paper mache, but be aware that the wardrobe and the fireplace cannot be shot through. This is the same as a previous house, easily shot through. The barn house is really easy to shoot through like the other meme houses, allowing you to shoot through everything but the ceiling with 8 or higher. Apart from the doors and the windows, this house is very difficult to shoot through. Same as the previous one, Grand's house is very strong. On this house you can shoot through the ceiling with a 30 but the rest of it is really solid. This raised house is really difficult to shoot through apart from the doors. Same again, very difficult to shoot through but be aware that you can shoot through this middle part with an 11 or higher. I believe this house is bugged, it's made entirely of metal which is easy to shoot through with 11 or higher. The floor and the ceiling however cannot be shot through. Both the pipes and the floor can be shot through easily with 11. On this building only the windows at the back can be shot through. This building is very difficult to shoot through, even the doors require 30 or higher. In the lathe workshop the laves cannot be shot through and the window frames require 30 or higher. You also cannot shoot up to this floor. This building is complicated, the ceiling here cannot be shot through, but this part can with just 8. The outer wall cannot be shot through apart from this part of the wall which is 30. The glass doors can be shot through with 8 or higher but the other doors in the building require 16 or higher. The roof box walls can be shot through with 30 or higher and the floors can be shot through with 35 or higher but the walkways require 30. Apart from the windows on this building everything else cannot be shot through. The door and the machine they're bulletproof. The walkway floors cannot be shot through and the only interior areas on this building are these two small rooms. On this building you can shoot through everything with 11 or higher. This metal part of the walkway and the stairs can be shot through with 11 but the mesh part here is bugged I believe and cannot be shot through. The only thing to note on this building is that the walkway here can be easily shot through. These yellow things and this roof box are easily shot through with 11 or higher and this room's walls can be shot through with 43 or higher. These air vents can also be shot through very easily too. These machines I believe are bugged, you can shoot through them very easily with 11 and so can the walkway. This floor on the crane can be shot through but the rest of the crane is impossible to shoot through. No part of this crane can be shot through either, not even the mesh here. The different variants of the construction sites of which there's three, none of them can be shot through. You cannot enter this building, the walkways and the panels on the left side can be shot through with 30 or higher. This staircase silo can be shot through with 30 or higher on the stairs. This silo cannot be shot through. The concrete floors cannot be shot through but the staircase and this mesh can be with 12 or higher. This floor here can be shot through with 30 or higher and this ceiling can be shot through with 35 or higher. You cannot shoot through these 10 cylinders. The roof box ceiling here can be shot through with 30 or higher but nothing in the bunker can be shot through. Most of this downed helicopter can be shot through with 16 or higher. Similar to the MI8 but I'd recommend 30 or more to shoot through the centre. Camo netting is extremely easy to shoot through, even the player placed camo netting on tents. These green guard houses are difficult to shoot through unless you have 30 plus. The door here requires 19 or more to shoot through and the beds cannot be shot through nor can anything else but the roof can be shot through with 11 or higher. 
It's much easier to get through the doors on this one, but you cannot shoot through the roof. This barracks building can be shot through a lot, the southern wall here can be shot through with 35 or higher, and the inner walls with 30 or higher. This one is very difficult to shoot through. The outside wall here can be shot through with 30 or higher, and the inner walls can be shot through with 43 or higher. You cannot shoot through the stairs. In this building you cannot shoot through anything but the doors and the windows. Very easy to shoot through at 11, but the beds cannot be shot through. The bullet physics engine barely even considers tents so everything can shoot through it, only the objects inside tents can protect you. The only thing you can shoot through here is the inside doors at 8. Nothing but the doors and this window wall can be shot through with 12, these large doors however cannot be shot through. This weird box thing can be shot through easily with 11. The ceiling of this building, the inner walls and the outer walls can be shot through with 30 or more but the ramp and the underside cannot be shot through. This building is difficult to shoot through and these windows cannot be shot through. You can shoot through this wall on this building with 35 or higher. This guard tower is impossible to shoot through, you can only shoot through the gaps. You can shoot through the nest here with 30 or higher but the base and the spotlight cannot be shot through. The only weakness of this bunker is shooting through the roof. This bunker requires 30 to shoot through the roof and just 11 to wall bang this wall in the middle. No sandbag wall in the game can be shot through. The wooden parts of this bunker are easily shot through with 8, the rest of this structure however cannot be shot through. This wooden guard post, well, yeah you can shoot through it. The smaller of the ATCs, all of the metal parts here cannot be shot through but the lockers and the door can be. This wall can be shot through with 35 or higher and the stairs cannot be shot through unless you're shooting through the gaps. The larger ATC, the metal stairs can be shot through on this one with just 8, but this small wall cannot be shot through unlike the other one. Everything but the furniture can be shot through making it very different to the smaller ATC. These machines can be shot through with 30 or higher. Just like the one with the bunker, the roof box can be shot through with 30 or higher. The doors on the side of this building can be shot through with 11, but nothing can shoot through the doors on the front. If attempting to shoot through the windows, the bars cannot be shot through. These glass windows however don't exist so you can shoot through them with anything. This ceiling can be shot through with 34 or higher. Again this guardhouse's ceiling can be shot through but much easier at only 11. This also is a very strange building, sometimes you can shoot through a surface and sometimes you can't, it behaves very strangely. If you have a theory on why this happens let me know in the comments. You used to be able to shoot through these hangars with everything but now you can't at all. The doors on this building are difficult to get through at 30, but the metal parts of the outer wall can be shot through at 11. The window frames cannot be shot through on this building, and the small structure inside can be shot through with 30 or more. Like other tents in the game, these are very easily shot through. On this military plane you will need 30 or higher to shoot through the outer wall. This guardhouse is very similar to the one with the gate, this one is without the gate. This guardhouse's ceiling, unlike the other one, cannot be shot through. This is also a strange building, sometimes you can shoot through the surfaces, sometimes you can't, it's very weird. The outer walls can be shot through with 43 or higher on this building. The Livonian ATC has nothing that you can shoot through at all, this is probably one of the strongest buildings in the game. The old war bunkers also cannot be shot through. Sandbags are very strong, you can't shoot through these. The Hesco barriers that are not as full as you can see here can be shot through with 30 or higher, but you cannot shoot through the other Hesco barriers. You cannot shoot through this dome at all. If one of these green tables is not part of a building and it's placed individually, you cannot shoot through it, but if it is part of a building, like inside a tent, you can shoot through it with just 11. The floors and ceilings of this building can be shot through with 35 or higher, but the central roof cannot be shot through. These walls can be shot through with 16 or higher. This front door frame cannot be shot through and the window frames require 30 or more to shoot through. The roof box cannot be shot through. The outer walls of this building can be shot through with 30 or more and this glass requires 8. The doors are strong on this building, requiring 30. The door windows can be shot through easily with 8, but the wooden part requires 16 plus to penetrate. This table thing cannot be shot through. This part of the train cannot be shot through. With the wooden train carriages you will need 30 or higher to shoot through the sides of the carriages, but only 16 for the door. The ceiling and the east and western walls cannot be shot through. The base of the train carriages cannot be shot through. 
This overhead power structure, whatever it's called, no part of it can be shot through at all, not even through the gaps. This thing is bulletproof. The same goes for these poles. And the same goes for the crossing gate. The train bridge, however, can be shot through with 30 or higher. The inner walls of the back rooms can be shot through with 30 or higher. The floor can be shot through with 35 or more to kill these pesky campers, also allowing you to wallbang from various creative positions. However, the staircase and the ceiling cannot be shot through. These two police station variants are the same apart from the sign outside the front. Nothing but the doors and the windows can be shot through here, but these doors and these windows made of this material cannot be shot through. Another strong building, not even the objects on the roof can be shot through. These windows and doors can be shot through with eight or more. This building is a bit tricky. None of the doors can be shot through apart from the front door at 12 and the inner walls can be wall banged at 30 plus, but only from room to room. You cannot wall bang from the hallway into the room or the room into the hallway. Be aware also that the window frames block 30 or less here. The fire station is the only haunted building in Daisy. In this room, sometimes bullets hit something in midair, concluding that there's ghosts and they're, they're very angry about something. So if you know why they're angry, please let me know in the comments. This shower area can be shot through the wall here with 30 or more. The outer doors require 30 or more, but the inner doors require 12. The stairs in this tower require 30 or more to shoot through, and so can this part of the ceiling with 30 or more. It's difficult to shoot through anything in this building apart from the windows and the doors and the objects on the roof can't be shot through either. Nothing but the doors and the windows on this building can be shot through but these bars and the window frames cannot be shot through. Nothing can be shot through here, not even the doors or the bars on the windows. It's like a fortress, making it one of the strongest structures in Daisy. These three metal sheds can be shot through with 30 plus but the rusted one can be shot through with just 11. These variants of wooden sheds can be shot through with 8 or higher. Be aware that an open door on these three bigger sheds makes it more difficult to shoot through. The concrete sheds are pretty solid, but the doors can be shot through with 11 or higher. The single garage is the same, but the ceiling can be shot through with 11. You cannot shoot through the outer walls or the doors to anybody inside this garage, but you can shoot from garage to garage through the inner walls at 30. The doors can be shot through with 11, the northern wall can be shot through with 35 and the side walls with 43. The glass ceiling is very easy to shoot through with 8. Easily shot through with 11 or more. The windows can be shot through with 8 and this room can be shot through with 35 or higher. The ceiling can be shot through with 16 and this wall requires 43. The other outer walls on this building cannot be wall banged. These are very easy to shoot through with 8 or higher. Be aware that the frames will block some bullets. These are impossible to wall bang, but the doors and the windows. You can shoot through the ceiling here, but barely at 43. The doors can be shot through with 30, along with the floors at 30 as well. These boxes can be shot through with 12, but I would recommend going with 30 for consistency, and the hay is very difficult to shoot through. This one is impossible to shoot through, and the door requires 30. To shoot through anything on this building, you will need 30 plus. These central pillars cannot be shot through. Most of the small sheds in Livonia can be shot through easily, but I'd recommend 30 or higher for the best results. You'll need 30 or higher to shoot through the ceilings, outer walls and the doors. This shed is easily shot through with 11 or more. These two supermarkets are the same apart from one being on a platform. The one that isn't on a platform has two doors at the back that cannot be shot through, otherwise it requires 30 to shoot through. The inner and outer walls apart from the one on the front can be shot through with 35 plus, but I'd recommend 43 plus for this building. Be aware that you can shoot through the sides of these cashier desks, but not through the back wall at all. This counter here cannot be shot through, but the shelves can at 16. Surprisingly, no part of these kiosks can be shot through apart from the door. I'm calling this one the hot dog kiosk because of the sign, as this one looks very similar to the blue kiosk. But this one's door is bulletproof, making this building like a mini bunker. The newspaper kiosk, on the other hand, is very easy to shoot through at 11. The concrete walls here cannot be shot through, but the roof and door can be at just 8. The doors and window frames on this one are difficult to shoot through at 30. Be aware that the cashier desk, the back wall here, is bulletproof. This building is pretty much bulletproof. The doorway on the back is also bugged, not allowing any bullets to go through. 
Another strong one, you can't even wall bang the metal on the front. The doors and the windows also require 30 plus. The radio tower requires 30 or more to shoot through the floor, through these cross beams and through these large pillars. The ladders and railings don't appear to exist so anything can shoot through them. The smaller version of the Ultra radio tower can't be shot through at all, but the railings and ladders like the other one don't exist so anything can shoot through them. These can be shot through easily with 11 plus on all parts. The only part that can be shot through is the floor on the walkway and the doors. The walkway is easily shot through on this building at 11. There are two similar smokestacks, this one has holes in the walkway and can easily be shot through at 11. This smokestack has solid concrete floors that cannot be shot through, even the metal floor attached to it can't be shot through, however this massive industrial machine can be shot through with just 11. This tower is easily shot through with 11, even the dish and the control box is 11. The framework cannot be shot through but the power cable and floor can, requiring 0 to shoot through the power cables and 30 to shoot through the floors, but I'd recommend higher. The same as a previous tower with the framework being impossible to shoot through but the power cables require 30 to shoot through instead. You can shoot through the nest easily with 11 but 30 is required for the frame. This building is mostly difficult to shoot through, however the front desk is easily shot through and you can shoot through into the stairwell from the sides or from the stairwell to the sides at 30 or more. Most of this vehicle can be shot through with 30 plus but the chassis cannot be shot through. You cannot shoot through any parts of these vehicles. These carriages require 11 to shoot through but 30 for the door. Buses can be shot through with just 8, the seats and the front portion of the bus can be difficult to shoot through though. Most parts of cars like this can be shot through with 12 and up, staying behind the engine block is the best way to use this as cover. These types of vehicles cannot be shot through. The engine bay here provides the best protection otherwise you can shoot through it with 11 or more. Humvees are difficult to penetrate on the back end and the front, uh, but the engine area is the most difficult to shoot through. The chain link part of these fence variants are not considered by the engine as a surface type so anything goes through, however the posts are surprisingly difficult to shoot through so be aware of those. Most concrete walls are bulletproof in the game but this one and this one can be shot through with 34 or higher. Most metal surfaces can be shot through with 11 or more but this variant has panels that are bulletproof depending on the panel you shoot. The problem is I can't identify which types can and can't be shot through, maybe someone has an idea in the comments. Wooden fences are easy to shoot through at 8 but many tend to have parts that are thicker than others so be aware of that. You can shoot through the wooden part of the top of this dirt barricade but you cannot shoot through the dirt. The doors are bulletproof on this warehouse but everything else on this structure is easily shot through at 11. Everything here can be shot through at 11 including the pillars. These doors are easily shot through at 11 and the ceiling can be shot through with 30. The inner pillars cannot be shot through. The front folding doors can be shot through with only 11 but requires 30 on the other doors in the building. The metal walkway can be shot through with 11 too but the other floors cannot be shot through the concrete parts that is. The roof is made of some sort of bulletproof metal just like this panel here which is probably the most bulletproof thing I've seen in this game. The outer doors require 11 while the inner doors require 30 plus. None of the walls here can be shot through. Almost identical to the previous warehouse, outer doors require 11 while 30 is needed on this white door. These panels can be shot through easily. Not much to say here, very empty, doors can be shot through with 11, everything else is solid. Everything here can be shot through with 12 plus. Apart from swans, everything is easy to shoot through in amusement parks. The outer walls and ceilings cannot be shot through on churches and the doors are very difficult to shoot through on most, requiring 16 on this small church and shrine, 30 on the two larger churches and a massive 43 on the Livonian church variants. This shrine requires 8 to shoot through the doors though. The walls of ruins are very difficult to shoot through but the floors of the castle ruins can be shot through with 30 or higher. This wooden staircase can be shot through with 16 and the floors of ruined houses from Livonia can be shot through with 30 or more. The hull of the ship cannot be shot through but most of the inner walls and floors can be shot through with 30 plus. Unlike other wooden structures the tavern is difficult to shoot through, the window frames require 30 or more and the doors require 16, however you can shoot through the floor with 34 or more. The lighthouse cannot be shot through like at all. 
Surprisingly, the door can't be shot through, but the northern and western wall can at just 16 plus. The only way to shoot into this one is through the door at 11. Everything but the outer walls is easy to shoot through, requiring 30 or higher on the outer walls. Another complicated building, the hangar part of this building's outer walls can be shot through with 35 plus, while the hangar doors require just 16 and the ceiling is 11. The doors on the main building are 12 plus, where the inner walls can be shot through with 30 or more, and the outer walls and ceilings of the main building cannot be shot through. The only weak points of the summer camp houses are the windows and the doors, both requiring 30 to shoot through, the frame of the window that is. Beware that the door frame on this building cannot be shot through but the ceiling can at 30. This can be shot through with 11 but the pillars require 30. The roof of the bus stop can be shot through with 35 while the pillars require 30. The gas pumps can be shot through with just 11 but the rest of the structure cannot be shot through. No part of the ski lift structure can be shot through but this wall can be shot through by everything because it doesn't appear to have a surface type attached to it. Also the walkway floor here can be shot through with 30 plus. 30 or more is required to shoot through containers that cannot open and 30 is required to shoot through one layer of a cargo container that you can open. Concrete objects are generally very very difficult to shoot through. AI and players are difficult to shoot through, 30 or higher is required to shoot through the chest of a player or an infected. These fuel containers found around the map cannot be shot through with any weapon. Items on the ground are random when it comes to knowing if you can shoot through them or not, but if it makes this sound, then it cannot be shot through. It appears that this is maybe the default surface type and it's bulletproof. The only way to shoot through hay bales is diagonally, you can't shoot through the front or the side of one. Here are the various strong metal objects in the game, they either cannot be shot through or aren't worth shooting through. This arrow will tell you which objects require which pen powers to shoot through. Note that the small bus stop cannot be shot through, but the large one can. The only post that can be shot through is this black and yellow one at 30. Here are the various strong wooden objects in the game that either cannot be shot through or aren't worth shooting through. Again, this arrow will tell you which objects require which pen powers to shoot through. Bushes are one of the easiest things to shoot through in the game, I'll explain why people think they eat bullets in a future video. You can shoot through the walls, but the door is the best option for maximum damage. The door you can shoot through with buckshot. Here are some random objects that I have left over in this video. You've got scarecrows at 8, these can't be shot through. The water tower floor can be shot through at 16, but the water container can't be shot through. The bottom of Wales can't be shot through but the top can be at 30 or more. The bus stop sign requires 11 or more to shoot through. This bridge cannot be shot through. These bags can't be shot through. And only one layer of these metal containers can be shot through. And finally, the concrete parts of these signs cannot be shot through. That was a lot of info. I'll be putting all of this onto my website in the future when I build it, so it's more readily available to you guys and easier for me to update. Now I'm really hoping that the devs change some of this as some of it is clearly broken, or at the very least someone can create a mod to patch it and balance this a bit better. If you watched the whole video let me know in the comments because you're a legend, but the biggest legend of all here is the one for allowing me to use his script to spawn all of the buildings in a row here, it saves me a lot of time so he's an awesome guy for that. Thank you for watching, stay away from wooden houses and have a good day.